Hi everybody. Today I'm making roses tucky. So I have the whole tucky breast right here and I'm using it my own way to do this and I'm going to show you what I'm going to do. So I'm going to use a whole bag of roast duck seasoning. So I'm going to use the whole bag. You can buy this in um, the Vietnamese or Chinese supermarket. You use the whole bag. So I'm putting it in here. Just more over so you can see. So I use the whole bag. Um, just cut it out. I usually do this ahead of time so when it get ready I can just put in the oven so I'm using one bag of the roast duck seasoning and one tablespoon of the soy sauce one tablespoon of soy sauce I'm gonna put it right in here together okay. and I'm using one just one teaspoon of sugar because the roast duck seasoning they have every spices in here so I'm not using anything else so I'm mixing this together after you mix together, after you clean the turkey, you clean the same way I did to the chicken. You have to clean really, really good. Um, so now after I mix all the uh, sauce together, I'm gonna go over the turkey. From outside, inside, from every spot. So after, um, Okay, and make sure you put some soft inside too. Yeah. Okay, you do one side of the turkey and then you flip in the all the other way. And uh, my son Brandon and Ethan love turkey. They love roast turkey the way I make. Okay, we'll just turn it around. You can go under the skin. Go all over. It's a big different flavor after it's finished. I'll show you. Um, so after you put it on, I'm going to leave in the refrigerator. for about two hours. So make sure you get all this part, the skin. So when I do the turkey, I don't take the skin out because you need that a little bit of the uh, moisture in the chicken. Or the chicken I took it out, but the turkey, you leave it on because you, you go into uh, Put in the oven and bake it for a long time. I don't want to dry out the, the turkey. So okay, after you put all the sauce in here, you're gonna move the turkey around. Make sure you get every spot cover. Okay, go all over. And then I'm gonna just cover that. And then I put in the refrigerator for two hours. After two hours, I'm coming back and I'm going to show you what it looks like after two hours. Before we put in the oven to uh, roast it. So this is it. After I put the sauce on, try to, do, try to buy the uh, roast duck seasoning mix. And then you, you, do, you do one time and see how it's... Uh, if you like roast pork from Chinese restaurant, 
and you um, try to do this it's exactly the same way they do rose quartz all right so i'm gonna leave in the refrigerator for two hours and when i come back i show you what it looks like okay bye okay so after two hours i put the uh, turkey in the refrigerator took it out i'm gonna place in the baking pan and i'm just gonna over one more time when you put it in the oven to bake you make sure you go one more time with all the sauce and make sure the skin part is up so like this like this okay And so the the juice in here, I'm gonna just leave it here, and we're gonna use that after this. So now I have and I have two power potato and one pack of mushroom. The mushroom I'm cut into two four, just like that, cut in half and the other half. And so the sauce right here, I'm gonna just use that later on. So I'm gonna just save it, and now I'm gonna wrap with the foil. And the turkey. You just wrap it up with the foil. And you just take this out of the way. Okay. So now I'm going to use the foil. I'm going to wrap the turkey. Okay. So just foil. All over. Okay, I'm gonna get another sheet of foil and then I'm gonna wrap it around. So the first I would say the first uh, I don't know why I have this little piece right here, but I'm gonna just wrap it on top. The first 45 minutes to an hour, I leave the foil on like that just to make sure I cook the turkey. So, that I'm going to put this all the way. I'm just wrap around a baking pan. And in the baking pan, I have the rack, and I just put the turkey on top of the rack, so it won't touch the bottom of the pan. So I'm going to just put it in the oven. Okay, now I'm going to put the timers on for, I would say for 45 minutes. And then after 45 minutes, we'll come back and uh, check out the, the turkey and see how is the turkey doing. Look at how the mushroom and the potato looks so good. So after 15, after 45 into an hour, we're going to check the turkey uh, and then after that we add more minutes to it depend on how uh, the turkey and then before we turn off the oven 15 minutes before that we're gonna put a potato in there and then the mushroom but I'll show you a step by step after how we do it thank you in the, in the oven. I'm going to take it out after an hour, 15 minutes in the oven. I'm going to show you what it look like. Get the chopsticks so I don't hurt myself. I'm going to lift up. I want to see what it looks like. Okay. 
Okay, so this looks like this after one hour and 15 minutes. Okay, so it's almost done. So I'm gonna flip it over just like this and now it's almost ready. So I'm gonna put the um, the tomato, uh, potato in there and the mushroom before I close it down for another half an hour. So let me try to light this down so I can cook the other side. But at the same time when I'm doing that, remember the leftover sauce after we took the turkey out? I add in here one stick of butter. And I'm gonna just go over the skin. Okay, and in the meantime, I'm gonna place a potato in there. I'm just gonna put potato around it. Um, so when you make uh, the turkey, you use stuffing, but my kids don't eat stuffing, so I'm just you all eating because they like the potato. So are you potato for them? You're gonna eat what you're gonna make what your kid eat, right? So put them all in there. After I put in here I'm gonna cook for another half an hour, twenty minutes. And then I open the foil. It's the last minute we open the foil. And then the mushroom after. Right now I'm not gonna put the mushroom in there. But the mushroom is make it cook quicker than the potato. So when I put the potato in here, I am going to put some sauce on it to get the little bit of the sauce here. I'm going to just use the brush and brush through the potato so it's not going to be dry. So let's go around it. Until all oh, this potato and the sauce is all mixed together like that. Okay, now I'm gonna put the foil back, and then because I want the foil to go back in, because I want to cook the potato, so. Okay, now I'm gonna go open the, the oven. So I'm gonna put it back in here for like 15, 20 minutes and I will check it back and see how it's doing. And then we can put the uh, mushroom in there. Okay, the mushroom I'm gonna put it separate because I'm afraid of my kid not gonna light the taste of it. So I'm gonna put a little bit of salt on it. Remember, this is the sauce that we put in the, on the turkey and then left over on the bottom of the bowl. And I add one stick of butter and one teaspoon of the soy sauce. And I'm going to brush over the mushroom and I'm going to put in the oven to cook separate. So both of my kids don't like mushrooms, so I'm going to cook the mushrooms separately, um, just like this. So I put in a different tray, 
and I brush it over with the, the sauce that I have earlier for the turkey, the butter and the uh, duck, roast duck seasoning mist and uh, one teaspoon of the soy sauce and I just brush over the mushroom and I'm gonna put it in the oven. Yeah. Looking good. So let's see how it is when we take it out. Okay, so here you go everybody. After two more hours, and like to say two forty-five uh, two hours forty-five minutes. And the turkey is nice and golden. It's ready. And this is the juice from the turkey. Um, I just took it out. Very delicious and juicy. So all the potatoes are all well done and cooked. Nice and golden. It's beautiful turkey. And so remember, um, if you want to try it, you get to go to the um, Asian supermarket. Get the roast duck seasoning mess in one pack. You can do for the whole turkey breast. And this is it when it's come out. Nice, and you can serve with uh, my my kid love to eat the turkey with rice. So how beautiful it's come out. So nice and golden. So delicious. it. Thank you everyone for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.